LTC, we start with one of our charts. Just I want to give a quick update. And if you refer to our analysis, when the price was here, we discussed how we can look for trade anyway. As we can see, the price drop. And we mentioned with the price drop, we are not really interested to look for sell. And even we didn't have any opportunity for sell. All right. And nowadays, the way the market is moving is really corrective. And mostly whatever the trade we get is short term. Now, the question is whether we put this one in relative to this. And this is a flat for the next drop. Or internally, we can look at this one for continuation. Anyway, the way it's moving is very corrective. It doesn't give us a very good opportunity for, because we mentioned we're looking for buy. We're looking for the reversal, all right? By the way, still we're looking at this correction and we're looking for the reversal. We mentioned if we get any opportunity for buy, we'll take it as a long term. And with the targets, we can look, we're looking for is 270, pulling away 318. But the way the market is moving is very corrective. And even we can expect the price to consolidate here for a longer time before we see the reversal. But uh, as we can see, based on daily chart, we don't have any opportunity for buy. And if we move to forward chart, as what I explained in my last analysis, we are still within this correction. And the best thing is if the price could give us one more drop with the breakout of the lowest price of this correction to confirm we're out of this, then any reversal from there, we will take it. We mentioned this is the best option we're looking for. All right, that's why I mentioned if the price reverse for within the video, the breakout of this correction, the lowest price of this correction, any trade will be a short term. And right now, still, we can consider if this one gives us one more drop with the breakout of the low, the lowest price of this correction, following by divergence, this is the best I'm looking for. All right, but if the price reverse from here, then we want to see whether the price can break at the top or not. Because any trade as a reversal from here, we consider as a short term trade. Now, what's the next? Whether we consider this one for one more drop before we look for the reversal. In that case, if the price is going to drop, we are not really interested to look for sell. We just wait for the price to drop. Then from there, we look for the reversal. But if the price reverses from here, any trade for buy, we consider as a short term. And with the breakout of the previous top, then we look for the breakout of, that's mean with the, we're looking to see the, first we have to see the breakout of 163 flowing by 170. All right. Then if the price could break 170, we look for 177 following by 190. Because if the price reverse from here, it couldn't break the 170, then from there we can expect the price to drop. How complex this one can be, we are not going to, into the details. The only thing is we prefer to see the drop. This is the best I'm looking for. Anyway, we're looking for buy, but we don't have any opportunity there for buy or sell at this point. And if, I'm, if I'm, we move to one hour chart, we can expect this one to deep, give us a deeper correction for the next drop. Whether we should look for sell or not, the only way is to put our entry below this and we want to price drop sharply similar to what we get here. It depends on the traders whether they want to look for sell or not. But even if we want to look for sell, we prefer this one turn to a deeper correction. All right. And if the price reverses from here, if anyone wants to look for buy, the only way is to look for the reversal as a short move flag. We will take the trade with the breakout of desktop, we move our stop loss to break even. Any trade, if the price reverses from here, we consider as a short term. Anyway, we just follow the chart. If I see any update, I will share. Thanks.